Hello everybody! Today, today is race number 70 for this girl. <laughs> um, we are at, gosh I haven't been here in a while, we are at Big Diamond Speedway literally rolling in and the cars are just heading out for hot laps. Tonight is the prelude to the coal cracker. I believe it's 50 laps, $5,000 to win. So it's a good night to come to the races. <laughs> um, Billy is racing and guys, I got, I got pants on and um, it's already cold. Oh, fall is coming. Oh, fall is coming. <laughs> Stay tuned and uh, yeah, get ahead to the pits. So we go back to the other one and we and we and we miss a heat race. So the rule of Big Diamond is if you don't attempt to qualify for a heat race or a con seat, you don't get paid. But the problem is there's only 23 cars, so there's no con seat tonight. So they were only going to give me 100 bucks start money and uh, to run this whole race. So uh, I get them for sticking by the rules, but you shouldn't have a rule like that if there's no con seat. So you know, uh, what are you going to do? It is what it is. There's 17 grand next week. I'm not going to get too worked up about it and. Uh, Work hard. Okay, so the night starts when I was getting here. Steve and I. Steve. Hello. We go to the track and we're like, where's Billy? Right? Doesn't go out for hot laps. Walk over. He's the only only car in the pits. And we're having issues, uh, which he explained. And then, uh, I guess, which, which is fine. Don't get us wrong. Like, we all agree, like, the track they stuck what is it stood their ground they followed the rules they stuck to them they didn't bend whatsoever so definitely give them kudos for that however it really just stinks on our end is that we had no idea that like there wasn't gonna be a con seat or that we couldn't scratch and go to the back of the last heat because we were in the first heat out of three everyone qualified but no con seats. so guess that's what happens when you don't really fully know the rules right so they discussed it they looked at the rule book and unfortunately it was not in our favor so literally I don't even think he made a lap and it's nine o'clock and we're on the road where are we going the car is clean we're going to red robin yum, yum. <laughs> I mean we are kind of at least in decent spirits kind of have to be it's early the sun literally just set like probably 30 minutes ago yeah and we aren't even saying for the future we're heading out it stinks but i know billy will be back hang on pause checking clear clear go 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 um billy will be back for the cold cracker next sunday so he's coming back for redemption i think everybody needs a comment for mandy and myself does this race count I've got a wristband. Does it count? Oh. We didn't actually see a race, but we paid to get in. Does it count? What if it was a I new think, track? I this think happened? we saw one lap of hot laps. One okay. lap of hot laps. You might have. Okay. 
Uh, I might have walked away. I don't think I saw. I think it racing. counts. I got a wristband. Yeah, that's true. I got a wristband too. It's going in the fishbowl. <laughs> you have a fishbowl? I have a fishbowl. Oh. Eighty-two bands made it last year. Wow. Okay. All right. Cool. Interesting. I've just I'll check out that fishbowl. It's a good idea. Anyways, <laughs> I'm just thinking about a fishbowl. So we are heading out to dinner. Um, for Billy's sake, I really hope his luck turns around because. I think, you, you know when you're like super tired and you just kind of start to get goofy? I think he's like past the stressed, this stinks, like <laughs> what, what could happen next kind of thing. Yeah. So he's off to New Egypt tomorrow. I'll be at Bridgeport tomorrow. Where are you going tomorrow? Ah. ah. That's all you guys get. Ah. ah. <laughs> <laughs> all I right. will probably be at New Egypt. Uh, We'll probably be watching Race Monitor for Mike Mahaney tonight. Yes. Oh, that too. Seriously, I'm, I was just talking to him. Can we turn the air back on? I'm hot. Thank you. Um, I was just talking to him before we got to the track, and he was having issues too that he missed hot laps. And then we get there and we missed hot laps. I'm like, oh no. So I just texted him when we got in the truck. I was like, honey, please tell me you're gonna have a better night than we are. So, oh man. So we're heading dinner. Got to our ride back home. And that's racing for you folks. Wanna close out? Make sure you like the video, subscribe to Mandy's channel, and we will see you, well, she'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Good night.